Hello friends. We've been reading lots of books about colors and we know that there are colors all around us in the world. Today I have a book for you to read to you today and it's called Dog's Colorful Day. And this book was written by Emma Dodd. And looking at the cover of this book, what do you think this book will be about? Hmm. Are you making a prediction about what you think it might be about? It says here, a messy story about colors and counting. What does messy mean? Messy does usually mean that there are things everywhere. So as I read this book, you can count with me in your brain as I'm reading Dog's Colorful Day. Dog's Colorful Day. This is Dog. As you can see, Dog is white with one black spot on his left ear. At breakfast time, Dog sits under the table as usual. Dog sits under the table at breakfast time. Hmm. Splat! A drip of red jam lands on his back. Now Dog has two spots. One, two. After breakfast, Dog runs outside. He slips past the man painting the front door. Splish! His tail dips into the blue paint. Now Dog has three spots. Let's count them. One, two, three. Hmm. Dog runs to the park and rolls on the grass. Squash! The grass makes a green stain on his white coat. Hmm, how many spots does he have now? Now, dog has four spots. One, two, three, four. I'm noticing something about how many spots he's getting. Dog follows a little boy eating chocolate. Squish! The boy gives Dog a chocolatey pat, but no chocolate. Now Dog has five spots. What color is chocolate? Do you see the spot that's chocolatey? Brown, you are right. A bee buzzes up to see what's going on. Swish! The bee drops yellow pollen as it flies by. See that bee? Now, dog has six spots. Dog trots on through the park. Splash! A drop of pink ice cream lands on his right ear. Now, dog has, let's count, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven spots. Time to go home. Dog runs up the street. Splash! A bouncing ball splatters dog with gray mud. Ooh, does this picture help you know what splatter means? Splatter is a big juicy word. Hmm, when you look at this picture, does it help you know what splatter means? It splatters dog with gray mud. I can tell that splatter means he's like getting splashed by mud. Now dog has eight spots. In front of the gate, dog steps on a carton of orange juice. Splurt! A patch of orange appears on his leg. Now dog has 
nine spots. Dog races back inside the house and knocks right into Vicky. Silly dog. Vicky's purple marker leaves a smudge on dog's head. Now dog has, ooh, let's count together. Vicky put another spot, let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now dog has ten spots. Vicky looks down at dog. She counts his colorful spots. Oh, and you know what I notice? Look at the numbers on the bottom of the page. They go all the way up to 10. Count as I point to the numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You counted with Vicky. Ten spots. Vicky looks more closely. Dog has a red spot of jam, a blue blob of paint, a green stain of grass, a brown smear of chocolate, a yellow patch of pollen, a pink drop of ice cream, a gray splatter of mud, an orange splash of orange juice, a purple smudge of ink, and of course, a black spot on his left ear. You need a bath, dog. When dog climbs into bed, he has just one black spot left on his ear. Good night, dog. What a colorful day you've had. Look at dog, what is he dreaming about? You are right, he's dreaming about colorful bones. I wonder if that's what he'll hunt for tomorrow. Maybe he'll go out and hunt for some colorful bones. What do you think?